Hiya folks, it's a laugh and order here and I'm coming to you from this location sorry I'm having to speak a bit loudly because it is a very busy road and uh, there's loads of big trucks like that going past but yeah, I'm here, I'm in Wandsworth ladies and gentlemen and I'm coming to you from the Wandsworth Council and Civic Offices and, uh, and yeah, I thought I'd do another council one because they always seem to go awry for some reason I wonder why that is what is the common denominator that these council complexes don't like people coming and doing a little bit of filming? Is it a lack of uh, accountability maybe? I think that's got something to do with it. I don't want the British public seeing how their British taxes are being spent, that's what it is. So, I say I'm here to have a look around, we'll take it from there. In the meantime guys, if you do enjoy this video, please like it, feel free to share it, and don't forget to pop down and hit that subscribe button. I would really appreciate it, and we'll certainly see if we get any laughs out of Wandsworth Council today. So let's go and do our nosy. Got to see do I like the, uh, the murals on the wall. Is the oh, it's open. Oh, it's open there. Eh? Oh, Jesus, it's a bit uh, something else in here, isn't it? That's the main reception that way. What's this way? It's a registrar's reception. Oh, interesting. What an interesting place. Open in 19... that seems older than that. 1993. Written one. Oh, that's a little registry office you get taken in there to sign your little certificates and whatnot. <laughs> So I've gone for the 2025 London Borough of Culture here. So now, let's see how they got on. There's someone hiding in there, which is fine. Look at that old cash register. Jeez, that is old, the old town. Main reception, let's find it. Victoria room, Elizabeth room, they're all named after Queens. That's a Victoria room in now. Yeah, this looks like the main reception here, folks. Oh, I think there's a wedding on. Right. Looks like there's a wedding on or something. Uh, citizenship, I don't know. Oh, Look at that! So that reception is absolutely heaving with people guys, so I'm just going to give it a little minute and let it calm down a bit. Uh, oh, the day we sticking my feet in, go for a wee paddle, ladies and gentlemen cool myself off a bit. I need to be careful because I've kind of shot myself in the foot today. Normally I come provisioned with drinks and water and whatnot and I've just not had a chance to get to the shop before I came here. So I'm hoping I'm going to be able to stay out the heat and it's not really going to bother me. Now I was planning to come through this way. This is the way I came in. So it was. I think where the deliveries are. Look at that, why have they got a cannon? It's 
Oh, our fountain is here. Cannon made in Wandsworth. Supplied to HMS Victory. Right, it's on loan to Wandsworth Council. Right, let's get back out here. I can't get out this way. Administration and Finance Departments. Jeez, look at the size of it, guys. What's going to be around here? I didn't expect that. All right, to be fair, I didn't do much research into the area. You know, uh, to check out the, the full scale of this establishment. It's very similar to the place in uh, Islington. Jeez, there's a dumping ground in there. See, it's just all rubbish. Bits of wood, old office chairs. Jeez, oh, look at the state of that in there. Wow, the ceiling's hanging off everything. I don't know if you guys can see through the window. That is really bad. That's really bad. Jeez, it goes on for miles. It goes all the way around the back to the other side. Where's that guy going? What's he got again? He's nicking office equipment. I hope you're only borrowing that. <laughs> He's nicking computers and everything, guys. He's filling up his car. <laughs> listen, you wouldn't be the first person that we've caught in the act of uh, nicking office supplies from the councils. We've seen it in quite a few places. Some have. Most notably in Crawley. If you've not seen the video, check it out. His attempt at hiding it wasn't even good either. Which is the customer service centre. See what the service standards are like. Nah, I'm just being nosy. Mm? I'm just being nosy. Being nosy. Yeah. Oh, okay. Business permits. Four hundred and sixty pound a year. You got a twenty fifteen pound discount, you apply online or something like that. Is it a permit? I don't like. I don't give you permission to film me. I, I don't need your permission, unfortunately. You, you do, my I, I, I don't, unfortunately. <laughs> I, I go about all over the country doing this. I, I don't need your permission. Not That's enough. okay. Are no. you here to um, discuss anything with somebody? No, I'm just or? being nosy. I just want to have a look around Wandsworth Council today and oh. sort of see what local services are on offer, what local schemes are on offer. Right, and without just organising do, it? I don't need okay. to. It's a public oh, place. You go ahead then. I, I will. Thank you. Have a nice day, yeah? Without organising it, what does that even mean? I have organised it. Jeez, I wish there was some water available. 
There's no water foot in here. This is what I wanted to look at over here. Put them over in this little corner here, guys. A privacy notice. No, I'm alright, thanks. No? Okay. Right. Have a nice day, yeah? Thank you very much, you too. Thank you. Oh, a polite lady. That's very nice. Yeah. Uh, you can ask. Yeah, yeah, you can ask. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. So, ladies and gentlemen, I am absolutely impressed. Very impressed at how Wandsworth Council are conducting themselves today. Um, if you want an example of how to do an audit correctly, or how to pass a TLA inspection, then these people are giving out a masterclass today. PhD level education to the other councils, these are this lot in here are giving out today. And there's one thing you'll notice guys, there is not I've not seen one single aggressive SIA holder security official. What an advert for the local authority and the local area and the local community. Now listen, I know I'm going to get people on both sides pop up in the comments saying one, Wandsworth is a wonderful place to live and work or two, it's awful or terrible. The cheap people that dogged up. But I can only pass judgement on what I see. What a lovely place. It's like an Italian piazza. It's not like you would think in Southwest London here. It's lovely. I like these impressive entrances, you know. Look at that. Very nice. Ah, oh, so it shows you the energy that they're collecting for solar power. Another means and then the CO2 savings 288,087 kilograms of CO2 I don't know if that's a lot but I've never seen one of them before I wonder how they get because it's live information I see the numbers ticking up I wonder where they get their data from Right. Yeah. Hello. Can I help you? Um, here for an appointment. I'm here to get a drink of water. Okay. I'm very hot. Yeah. Uh, Are you filming for a purpose? Yeah, of course. What is the purpose? Can just because I want to, my friend. It's what I do. I go about filming places That's that interest right. me. So what are you uh, going to do here quite early this morning? Well, I've been here maybe about an hour, less than an hour, yeah. Are you aware what happens in this area? I am, yeah. Okay, so you'd be sensitive to the fact that families are here to register deaths mm -hmm. and they're bereaved. Yeah. And can you appreciate that it's making them uncomfortable being filmed and... So, they're, they're, who, who's complained? Sorry? Who's complained? Nobody's complained. So what's the issue then? Because I'm just saying from a... From a Human perspective. I understand. So when I came, so I get your sense. So when I first came here earlier, 
I arrived in here. I had a look in there, there was no one there. No, okay. So I went around the rest of the building, I've that's come right. back because I've been looking for some water, it's the only fountain that's with that's a cup. And now that there's people there, I'm not going in there. So, so I'm respecting those wishes. And I was saying that they were coming through here. Yeah. So for example, when they've arrived and my staff have been dealing with them, yeah. uh, we just want to be able to, to say, it's courteous to say that if they're being filmed and if this is going to be shown publicly, that's going to be. Is it going to be shown publicly? I've not decided yet. Uh, don't make that yeah. decision at filming, to be, to be perfectly, perfectly honest with you. Yeah. Um, like, listen, I'm not here for members of the public, if that's what you're concerned about. I'm here for this marvellous building. Um, so I do try and mitigate filming members of the public, but I can't guarantee that they won't be captured in the background. Oh, this is a working place. Oh, okay. Pardon? Okay, would it be possible to complete what you're doing in this area or in move to Another part of the building? Yeah, I'll go, when, I'll go when I'm ready. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah, I'll go, I'll go when I'm ready. And can I ask you please to be courteous and not record to my staff because they're uncomfortable? No, you're the public servants, come on. Sorry? The public servants, a fair game. Like, you'd be paid for all at taxpayers' expense, so there's a reasonable sure. expectation that the taxpayer should come and scrutinise sure. what you're doing. I'm simply asking you. I appreciate you asking politely. I appreciate you asking professionally, but no, that's what I'm going to draw the line. Unfortunately, because okay. for like members of the public, I can understand that, but public servants, on the other hand, as I say, um, these are paid for by taxpayers uh, at the taxpayers' expense. So there's a reasonable expectation that the taxpayers should come and have a look around and see what you're doing, see if we get value for our money, essentially. Um, so, so I can't. That's where I draw the line. All right. But thank you for being polite. Um, can you give me any idea of the time frame now that you're going to be? Yeah, can we come to an agreement? Uh, no, I can't, unfortunately. Okay. Yeah, because I don't know myself, to be honest. So if I gave you information as to how long I'll be here, chances are it's going to be false. And I don't want to give you false information. I don't want to be seen to be lying to you. So, so yeah, I don't know. All right. Do All you right. have a website? Do I don't have a website, no. Can we look you up? Try. Sorry. You can try. Oh, well, I'm asking. I want to. I'd be interested to see the the content. Do you publish the content? Sometimes, yeah. And is it is it publicly available? It's sometimes, yeah. It depends on the video. Well, as I say, I don't make the decision at the time of filming. So, um, at this moment in time, I've not decided what's going to happen with this footage. It could end up on social media. I could keep it for. Um, my own purpose, I don't, I don't, I don't make that decision. I'll be very follow down the line. Okay. So, if it is public, then I'm sure you'll find I it. I realise this is a public building, but we deal with very sensitive matters here. I understand that, yeah. Yeah, and um, I just, we've got work to get on with, and... I'm not stopping you from doing your work, my friend. If you want to go back to your office and well, do your thing. you're staff uncomfortable. I've, I've barely interacted with your staff in this building. They won't be, they'll watch it there. They're, they're aware that they're being filmed. I've, I've barely, I think I've walked over to that window yes. once, so I've been here maybe twice, okay, but yes. no more than twice and for a second at a time. So I don't see how that could be making people uncomfortable. When I was here earlier, I was here for less than a minute, I had a wee look around and then I made my way around to the main reception. Um, I, I stopped to have a drink of water, you've decided to sit and have a conversation with me. I just so, want to find, I mean, obviously because we have to consider the security of the public and all. And what security? Like, sure that you mean no harm. What do you mean, you security? Explained like, you've explained that. Right, okay, because okay, security, covering, like a camera, covering, like... Yeah, you're covering camera. a backpack. Right, okay. You're covering your, your face. My face. I've put my mask down so you yeah. can see my face, you know, so... You're not here for an appointment, you're not here to use any of the services. So I'm here to, to look and see what's yeah. available. So... Members of the public that watch my videos do like to see what is um, yeah, what is available, what local services and opportunities are available. Can I watch them? Of course you can. Well, can you tell me how I would access you're, you're going to have to find it. I'm pretty sure that if this one does go public, um, yes. you, you will find it. Like, I'm, I guarantee you that. Like, you pretty sure you got a PR team that will that will find it here. Right. Um, it'll become. Well, thank you for for your assistance. I appreciate you being very polite and professional. I'm doing, I'm doing my best and I'm, I'm really... You're doing really well. You're a credit. I'm concerned for my service and you totally appreciate that it's uncomfortable for individuals being taken by surprise. Yeah. 
your cooperation, your understanding would be really appreciated. Yeah. You know, you're very welcome to, to explore the, the, the building. But do please bear in mind that this service area is for very sensitive. I understand that. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you so yeah. much. Thank you very much. Having a, sorry, my hands are really sweaty. You wouldn't want to shake them anyway, but no offence. All right. Have a nice day. Take care. Right, one last glass of water and I'm calling it a day. Now, he is strictly speaking true, they do register deaths here, um, but they also register marriages and buffs and all the other stuff, civil partnerships. So although he is strictly speaking correct, there's also a bit of ambiguity in what he's saying because um, he was just referring us only to death, trying to play on those um, heartstrings a little bit. So, but very professional, very polite. I can't complain, but I disagree with some aspects. So, anyway, let's move on. But yeah, very, very nice chap. To be fair, I don't really have much complaints. He was um, very professional. So, so I am uh, pleasantly surprised. Pleasantly surprised, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, so yeah, what can you say to that? Like, obviously, he's talking a lot about nonsense, right? But there is no point in situations like that me jumping down that man's throat. First of all, I think he'd burn bust out crying if he got uh, the full hair dryer treatment from me. Uh, second of all, if I did do that, I'd have been bang out of order. Um, because it's not warranted, he's been perfectly polite, he's been perfectly reasonable. He's not even asking me to leave, he's just saying, mind where you're filming because of X, Y, Z. And listen, X and Y is probably right in terms of the, the deaths and whatnot, but the members of the staff, that's where I draw the line and say, no, I can't, but um, public servants are going to get, uh, I am going to scrutinise them. Um, and he appreciates my point of view, he might not like it, um, but he's certainly not going over the top, so fair play to him. Fair play. So yeah, I'm leaving it there guys, what do you think? Very interesting, very interesting. Um, it's definitely got to be up there with one of the best council buildings uh, videos I've done. They absolutely smashed it, they were polite, professional at all times. There was, I think, two security guards that I've seen. Possibly only two, maybe even only one that I've seen. Uh, they sat there, quite relaxed, no issues whatsoever. They've done themselves a, an absolute credit today. They've done Wandsworth Council absolute credit today. Congratulations, Wandsworth Council. I am absolutely thrilled for you. It makes a change. So I am leaving it there, guys. I'm calling it a day. I'm moving on. I'm calling it quits. I think I'll end the video here. All right, folks. If you have enjoyed this video, please like it, feel free to share it, don't forget, pop down, hit that subscribe button, you've been watching The Laughing Auditor, this has been Wandsworth Council, I've absolutely smashed it, congratulations, I'll see you all very soon, take care, bye bye.